Cynthia Bailey from The Real Housewives of Atlanta, and I'm here today with Houston Style Magazine. Life is all about choices, and Miss Cynthia Bailey of The Real Housewives of Atlanta chooses fitness today. She's here for the Day of Wellness um, event that we have for Get Fit or Get Fat. I'm Totally Randy. This is Houston Style Magazine. Thank you for speaking with us. Thank you. Thank you for having me. This is a great cause. It really is. Now, the first thing I want to ask you, obviously, you are an amazing model, a legend for us. And I want to know, like, how do you tell those people who feel like they can't take that relatability or they can't relate to you because you're a model and they say, well, you've never had weight problems. So, you know, what do you tell those people? Uh, well, you know, first of all, I've had, uh, I have, I've never had a weight problem, but I've had health problems, which I think go hand in hand. Right. Um, you know, I think being healthy is just as much about being uh, it, it just that as opposed to what size you wear. You know what, what I'm saying? What are some ways that you chose to keep yourself healthy, like food, uh, exercise? Give us some of those. Yeah, I'm glad you brought up the um, battle that I had with thyroids because it definitely wasn't, it wasn't like so much of a weight issue for me. I was just gaining weight in a certain area, in my stomach area. And a lot of uh, African-American women suffer from fibroids, so I thought it was important for me to share it on the show because it was a part of my reality. Um, what I did after I, you know, had the procedure done that you guys all saw on the show, I just kind of made a lifestyle change. You know, I had my one day, I eat what I want, but for the most part, I eat, you know, very healthy. You know, I mean, I'm not like a vegan or anything. No, no, no disrespect to the vegans, I get it. But, you know, that's, you know, not my choice, but I do, you know, eat well, and I do try to exercise when I can but as well. But definitely, uh, what's new for Cynthia Bates? Uh, well, my school, the Bailey Agency School of Fashion, we just celebrated our five-year anniversary. Congrats. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, that's one of my platforms that I am the most proud of because I'm able to use it to empower and inspire, you know, young talent, you know, to just educate them about the business. Right. So that's, uh, you know, one of the things I'm super proud of. Uh, I've also started my acting career, so you guys will see. Yeah, we saw that. That's how I was like, look at her. Guan, I had to do that too. Right. Guan. That was Guan. <laughs> I don't know if I'll be playing any more Jamaicans anytime soon, right. but yes. um, you know I love acting, so that's you know something that I'm interested in pursuing. Oh. And then I also love um, accessories. I, I love fashion, but I, I I didn't choose to really do a clothing line at this point. Uh -huh. But I do love accessories. I love you know eyewear. I wear a lot of eyewear on the show. Everyone's like, who's who makes those glasses? You know who makes that hat? Right. So there's a hat line coming. There's eyewear. There's watches. Everything that you see me wear. It's gonna be coming out. Well, so. we definitely love that team beauty. Yeah, I can't wait for that, guys. Team healthy. Team healthy. <laughs> team healthy. Okay, Cynthia Bailey, you team guys. Happy. <laughs>